So, I'm going to tell you guys a little anecdote before we start today. Uh, when I was a wee little lad, a few years ago, uh, I used to watch before, like when, when Achievement Hunter vs. Teeth was kind of young, I used to watch uh, LTM Killa, who was Michael from Rage Quit. Um, I don't know why I said Wage Quit. Rage Quit. Um, and he used to upload playthroughs of his own things on his channel. And he did it pretty regularly for a bit. Um, he would do, like, um, I think when I first started watching, he had just finished Dead Space 2. And then he did Red Resident Evil 4, I think, and Banjo-Kazooie, uh, kind of intermittently. And then he eventually did Dead Space 1, which he did pretty quickly. I think he only did, like, ten parts of it. Um, and then he did Banjo-Tooie, but he started doing that on the Let's Play channel, which is um, owned by Achievement Hunter. And then eventually that kind of got phased out and he started he started finishing it on his own channel like he did like one or two parts and he would do basically one a year and that it just sort of tapered off like originally he would do a bunch at once and then he'd take some like a few months and then he'd go back to doing a couple and he would always come back and he would always be like oh man i like i like this game i can't believe i don't play it and just like you just you know just get busy and stuff like that and for a while, I was always like, I can't, how could you go like a year without putting out a part? Like, don't you want to like do anything? And it was just kind of like, it was so baffling to me. I kind of understand it now. Because <laughs> it's just, just things happen. Uh, so I, I looked, the last time I did a video in Monster Rancher, Monster Rancher 4 was 10 months ago. And at the end of the video, I even say like, oh, my disc is fixed. So I can definitely play some more soon. And I just didn't. So... I'm sorry for, for all of that. Um, yeah, it's not on purpose. It's just shit happens. Um, I don't know what to do here. Whatever. Um, I'm going to do this forever. I'm going to continuously just always forget to do that. Alright, so... Yeah, so let's do some more. I'm just gonna hop right into it. I, the reason I had to look at the old video was I had to be like, when was the last time I, or what was I doing last time I was playing this? And I didn't figure it out. <laughs> I looked at the end and I guess I was like, oh, I don't know what I, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I guess that's it. And I'm like, no, that's not it, dumbass. Like what? I get a little annoyed at myself. I was like, what do you? So I think we have to go back to the Kalaragi jungle. I remember it, that when I was reading the guide oh so long ago, like, you know, like a year or two ago. It was something crazy, like, I had to go there three times in a row. And I don't remember it exactly. I just vaguely know that's what it is. Hey, you're doing a good job. You keep it up. Um, but yeah, I mean, I've, I've gotten past this point at least a few times, like, on my own. And it's just, usually it's all, like, in, like, spurts. Like, I'm playing all, or not spurts. It's, like, usually, like, I burst. Like, I'll play a bunch of this game at once, and that'll be great. But that doesn't seem to be how this is going. Um, I guess we'll be fine. I, so, I'm just following the schedule I left for myself. So, I assume I have to go to a tournament this week. And then, uh, we'll go from there. So... Yeah, I feel bad. I, I mean, I genuinely do. There's no reason for me to, um... For me to put these off this long. But it's just, like, I... There's two reasons that I put this game off. I don't really... I enjoy playing it. And I enjoy the game. It definitely gets a little monotonous. Finally, it begins. The official grade rank, or grade rank E. The winner of this tournament will receive a voucher for rank D. Now, let's all give it our best. Begin the official rank E. Yeah, I totally like the game. Um, it's one of my favorites, and it gets decent views. It's just... I don't know. I, it's, well, part of it is that it's on my older PS3, and that's a pain in the ass to hook up, especially since my capture device for that one is kind of failing a little bit. Like, it's hard to set up. And then... So that's part of it. The other part is that... Uh, nobody ever really asks for it. So I kind of just play whenever. Um, okay, I don't know what to do here. 
I really just need to hit it once. <laughs> and it's not happening. Okay, can you... Can we all agree? Alright. I forgot circle was more accurate. So that's definitely the way I should be going. Do I have, like... What's the buttons to switch? Okay. I think you have to hold a button to counter, too. I don't know what the button is, though. That works. I'll take that. This is the issue, is that we finally unlocked the counters and stuff like that, and I don't remember how to do them. <laughs> I know X is basic attack, square is power attack, and circle is a... Uh, like a more accurate attack, but it does less damage. That's what I remember about this. So... I'm doing my best. I'm doing my best. Um, I still have to get through Ryu, and, or I can't upgrade. You also don't want to take too long when you do this, because your monsters will eventually die. And doing this on a second generation of monsters is fucking hard. It's just way harder than it needs to be. What's the button to counter? Is it L2? It is. Probably should have guessed that they were using squares, since they did like 17 times in a row. I hit X again! What am I doing? Alright, come at me, I dare you. Perfect counter. <sighs> I hate Final Guts, and I still don't... After all these years, I still don't know what triggers it. I've never figured it out. I think it's just luck. Alright. I'm doing okay. I think, um... He's probably doing... He's probably strong enough where I can... Do decently in this tournament, because he's been to the jungle a few times, leveled up and all that. Rex, come on, man. I believe in you. It was not X, in case you guys are wondering. So you can't you can't dodge if you do that. So you gotta be real careful. Um, also, there's no triangle attack. I'm learning. Composed. I forget what composed does. There's definitely different the bonuses do things, I just don't know what they do. I wanna have a high defense. I wasn't super ready for high defense. I need to get his attack up. I want it to be so that when I hit him. No matter what, they can just go down. Okay, moving right along. Dunk still looks to be, uh, if I lose to Dunk at this point, I'm still going to lose the entire league, which is bad. I need him to get at least one loss. I don't like worrying about these things. But these things are normally really slow, so I can hit him with a real heart attack. Give him a heart attack. It was X. Counters are super risky. I don't know why I'm doing this. I don't need to do this. It wasn't X again. Uh. Hold on. Me too. Me too. Hold on. Have you heard the good word? Wow. That does nothing. I don't even know why I had that attack there. But it hit, and that's what counts. Alright. If Dunk could lose, this would go really smoothly for me. Did he? I can't tell who won. I think he barely won. Damn it. Now there's so much pressure. Um, so yeah, I'm not going to make empty promises like I did last time. And be like, oh, I'll definitely play this again soon. I don't know if I will. Maybe. Hopefully. Oh. Oh, God. That's hideous. The teeth. Oh. It's so gross. Get rid of it. I don't want it here anymore. Oof, hardness. I don't know why I was worried about Dunk. Dunk went down like a bitch. Dunk went down the fastest. Whew. Perfect victory. Alright, record five wins, one or zero losses. Thousand dollar, a thousand gold. Got a carrot, a little bit of fame. If anything, I want the fame to go up because then enemies will just quit before you even have the match, which is ideal. Because then I don't have to do anything. But yeah, this series does well. I think people search on YouTube, and I don't think there's that many people have played it. So I've got that going for me. Schedule rest. 
trampoline. You should be resting. Okay. I think we're good. Nope. I'm just fucking got rid of it. There we go. I don't know why circle is... All I do know. It's because... Weird controls. Alright, I'm ready. I'm coming off Tag Force, and Tag Force has a speed up button. So I'm used to just speeding through all this, like, monotonous shit, and I can't do it, and it's bothering me. Slightly. I want you, uh... You did good, kid. Do you think it's like a beetle with, like, dragon parts? So, like, the inside is all bug-like, but the outside is, like, scales and shit? I don't know how the anatomy would work for this. Hey, you did great. Here's a potato. Enjoy. You fucking love potatoes. Enjoy it. I still don't know what I want for my next two monsters. I know I want a dragon of some sort, because those are fun. I don't know what else I want. Oh, you know what? Oh, yeah, I do. I want the Delahan. I forgot I got that. Um, I specifically got a disc from someone else's collection to make a Delahan when the time is right. Um, and I did not give it back to them. I've also had it for like a really long time. Like, much more annoyingly long than I should. Ooh, you also like potatoes. I'm Chester, what's wrong with me? Alright, well. On we go, another fight. And then, hopefully, they'll be rested enough where I can, uh, take them to the jungle again. In the jungle, I? I don't think I can fight Ryuan yet. Which is what's really holding me back. Ladies and gentlemen, coconut open. Interesting. Chester vs. Clay, Decker vs. Chara. It's gonna be a golden matchup, I can feel it. At least it's a tournament, though. Those are much easier. But yeah, this is... This makes it a little bit more manageable. It's been the, they're all at, like, different ranks. Oh, I remember this being a really accurate and annoying attack to dodge for them. <laughs> Could just keep flicking them. You guessed poorly. I faked him out. I did two squares in a row, then an X. That's how you get him. Alright. Surprisingly, the golem won. Golem on golem violence. What kind of golem is this going to be? A lizard one. I don't like that. I don't like the weird slick back hair it looks like it has. It also looks like it's... Speedy, which I don't like. Okay, so it's used everything pretty much. Damn it. Can you just let me hit him? Oh, I actually hit him with a power attack, too. You're damn right, you're bullish. Get out of here. Alright, that works. That's terrifying, to be caught in a rock tornado. Like, to like, I can see, like, I can see the attack. I'm like, oh, that's kind of cool. But, like, imagine just getting, like, pelted with stones while you're in the air and stuff like that. Stones hurt, alright? You have a lot of resistance. That, it's broken bones, blood, error, it's just, I don't know. Oh. I have stuff I can talk about, but it's just more of, like, I'm supposed to record more, and I don't know what to say when. I don't know what's appropriate for each video. Uh, you're talking about anime. This is a super anime-ish video. I have a lot of animes that I watched and I haven't talked about yet. Uh, right. I guess we can start with, uh, I'm looking at the list. I'm, I'm not just, like, randomly thinking. I'm, like, I'm cr craning my neck to look at my whiteboard to see what I wrote down on it. Uh, actually, we should look at the schedule. So nobody's going anywhere. They're both resting. I should make him rest too, actually. And then we can go to the jungle this week. In the jungle. No, okay. Um, yeah, I finally watched Kill a Kill. I started it, I should say. I didn't watch it. I um, I watched three episodes from start to finish, and I kind of just decided mm, it's not for me. I liked. I also watched Fooly Cooly for the first time, which is six episodes. Not because the new series was coming out, but because someone recommended it to me. 
and I just like I was just going off recommendations so I was just like uh right this is a thing someone told me to watch one time so I watched that the hell is Peepo is he hidden by Raxias um so I finally watched that Fooly Coolies what I like about that is that it doesn't take itself as how do I put this it's so these are all made by the same people um Gainix made Evangelion Fooly Cooly then Gurren Lagann, then Kill a Kill. There's others in between, but those are like the big ones, at least that I think. And, um, so those are the big ones, and I finally saw, I'd seen Gurren Lagann before, and I'd seen Evangelion. I'm really, really not a huge fan. Um, I should start scheduling these. I'm really, really not a huge fan of, um, uh, what's it called? Evangelion. I think it's not good. And then I think... Let's see this. And then, should I set these ones up too? Because I need people to be ready for the... The next grade up. Group battles. I can't believe those are introduced yet. Okay. Yeah, I can't progress until people gets enough. So I should definitely set them up for that one. Okay, and then Chester, I'm just waiting on the next, uh, open. Okay. That's good. Um, I was scheduling, yes. Um, but yeah, I really didn't like Evangelion. And I know people say it's like, oh, it's a classic and stuff like that. And it's like, oh, it's not. It's, to me, Evangelion was like the birth of bad anime. And by bad anime, I mean, here's a 20 episode series the main plot is really interesting, but the, we're not going to talk about the main plot. We're going to, like, sprinkle in bits for, like, a minute each episode. And then we're mostly going to talk about, um... <laughs> we're mostly going to just, like, give you slice-of-life shit that you don't really care about. I could give two fucks about Shinji, one of the dumbest characters in anime. And it's just, like, he had a character arc. I'll give him that. Like, it's just like, oh, you know, he was, he's, like, he's terrified to pilot. He's not, like, he's not shown in and stuff like that. He's not, like, yeah gonna be at the monsters. He's absolutely terrified. Does wants nothing to do with it, and they constantly have to convince him to get in the mech. That's where the meme comes from. Shinji getting the goddamn mech. And you're right. That's fine. But it's just you can only do that so many times in a row before I just get really fucking fed up with it. Like they they did that. They went to that gold mine like five different times. It's like Shinji, the world needs you. This person's in danger. You need to get in there. And he's like, no. Not to mention all the weird sex stuff. Like, clear, I don't know. It's That's a whole thing. There's papers written about the sexual themes of that. Um, and just so out there. Like, no, nothing made sense. I'm just like, I don't... It's not for me. Uh, Gurren Lagann, I really liked when I watched it the first time. And I've had trouble getting into it as much since then. Uh, like, I can, the only... I can't watch the series again. I can watch the two movies that, like summarize and like remix the series a little bit those are good um and that's very shonen it's like the opposite of Gurren Lagann it's, it's like I believe in myself and therefore we can fight uh, um so those are those are fun I don't like um but yeah so I didn't like that as much and then Kill a Kill I thought didn't take itself seriously enough like it was too Gurren Lagann, like, I, how do I put this? Evangelion took itself too seriously, and Kill a Kill didn't take itself seriously enough. And then right smack in the middle is Fooly Cooly, which was both ridiculous, but also took itself seriously at times, and also had a lot of the same themes as Evangelion, I thought. And I still liked it. I don't know, it just, it's, it's clicked for me. So, Fooly Cooly was great, Gurren Lagann's great. Kill a Kill, couldn't get into, people say it's great, but... It's, it's too anime for me, if that makes sense. It's too much wacky, crazy shit. And skimpy outfits. I'm just like, I don't... They're like, oh, but it's a commentary on this. Like, I don't care if it's a commentary. That's like, that's below. On the surface level, it's a bunch of girls in very, very scantily clad dressed things just like fucking fighting it out. I'm like, that's cool, but... You know, if you're into it, go nuts, but I can't watch it. That's too much for me. <laughs> Can you not, please? I very much appreciate you not hitting me. Oh good, I'm bullish now. I hate that random enemies can counter me too. Oh, just die. 
This damage is permanent. Die, please. Hit him. <laughs> Team up is so great. Okay. Uh, so that's those are my notes of Kill a Kill and Fooly Cooly, both of which I watched back when I was still um, working. That's another update if you're just watching this series in a row on a playlist, which the playlist gets a good amount of views too. Um, I left my job, slash got fired. Uh, it is a little bit, bit of both. It's not like, it's not like a, oh, you know, they, you know, I didn't want to leave. It's more of, um, it got bought out. So they got bought out by 7-Eleven a while ago. And finally the owners, uh, just couldn't deal with 7-Eleven anymore. So they sold it. So when the owners left, I had to reapply to work at 7-Eleven again. And like basically just so they could dock my pay or whatever. I don't know what they were going to do. I know that the reason most people do that is that they'll take, they'll just treat you as like a new employee, and that's dumb. I'm not gonna do that. And I, I need, I just use this as an excuse to leave. Currently job searching. If you have anything, uh, please let me know. No. <laughs> Anyone needs a writer, editor, copy, copywriter from off location? Please let me know. No. Um, but yeah, that's what I'm currently at. So, I have a little bit more time to record videos. I'm trying to get myself a schedule. We have 8 a.m. wake up, trying to keep myself as a human. Because if it were up to me, I would just sleep until like 2 every day. And that's bad. And I just stay up all night. And that's exactly the reason I stopped working the overnights. So was like I have a normal um, sleep schedule. So we have that. And then 8.15 to 9.15, exercise, workout. Go on my exercise bike, lift some weights, push-ups, sit-ups, all that fun stuff. 9 to 10, shower and eat breakfast. Uh, or 9.20 to... Nine to ten. So breakfast is usually just ramen. I had cereal today, and that was a mistake. I shouldn't have done that. Um, because I ate cereal, and like I was full of like cereal and milk, and then I went on the exercise bike, and I was just like, oh, oh no, I cannot do this. <laughs> My stomach was not feeling it. So I have to rethink that. Um, I don't really want to explore that much. Do I need to explore? I don't know what I'm missing. Um. So yeah did that and then what else did I do I oh right so then 10 to 11 is job searching did that today applied for a um, editing position in a textbook uh, we'll see if that goes through probably not uh, signed up for a few different websites like um, what's it school spring and then stuff like that um, hopefully that goes well so I got that out of the way. And then 11 to 3 is record, which I'm doing right now. So this is my last recording for the day. I've already recorded um, two Yu-Gi-Oh parts. So, I should be good. Man, they're going way too fast. Switch! 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 How do I switch? There we go. Oh, I forgot I could do that too. I forgot, like, um, I could switch in battle, like, right away. Hey, people got wind lore. Does he even have any wind attacks? I don't know what happened. I think I chose not to learn wind lore, which is unfortunate. So yeah, you can see the health they regain. It comes back somewhat quickly. I don't know if it comes back quickly or quickly. That's not a word. I don't know if, if it comes back quicker when you're um, when you use them in in your party or when you're riding with them or something. But it's the current plan. Can I fly with, um, Rex yet? I don't remember if I did that. I'm trying to remember the controls. I'm not fucking anything up. Yeah, I can't fly with him yet. Oh yeah, I can. Whee. I think this uses more energy though. But that's fine. <laughs> the, uh, the wing animation does not look good. It's, uh, it's pretty poorly animated. But I mean, it is what it is. Um, yeah, so then, um, after that, after three, if I choose to, I can stream, starting at four. Oh, good, I can actually do this part now. I can actually go over these. Actually, is there anything on the ground? I don't know if I take, I don't know if I can encounter battles when I do this. Um, but, uh, yeah, so I, I've been doing that. Or, so I can stream at four if I want to. I don't think I'm going to today. Still, to get adjusted to the schedule, I'd like to, like, try it out a few times first. 
So we'll see that. I'm just still not feeling it. OBS continues to be a giant colossal pain in my ass. That makes me not want to record. Um, oh, gold, Godal sword. A Goldal sword. Um, but yeah, so I recorded two Tag Force parts. That was fun doing this. I'll try and mix it up. Um, I think tomorrow I'll probably record some uh, Dragon Quest Eight. Probably get a Capsule Monsters part out there too. I haven't done that in a while. Hello. Very scantily clad. And she's dead. Just like every other woman I meet. What? That doesn't know. That's not a thing. I was gonna do a Final Fantasy XII part, but I think I might do that Wednesday. I'll try and do what's today? Tuesday? Maybe I'll maybe I'll do it Thursday. I'll do Final Fantasy and Valkyria Chronicles. I'm trying to I'm keeping a list. Um of the videos I'm recording, and like how many times I've recorded in them. Currently, Tag Force is very far in the lead. I've recorded eight parts of that since I made this list. So, all right. The main strategy here is to just keep on, keep on attacking until they're out of gets, and then just switch to someone else. No. Okay, switch to someone else, please. Right, they used the next attack. You just kick him over. Alright. Flying is fun, but I also don't want um, Rex to get too damaged. He's also the lowest level, so maybe I should try and use him. That's not good. That's just bad luck. That's not. That didn't seem fair. I'm taking that personally. Just keep on hitting them. Just keep hitting them. Just keep hitting them. Fury. Don't don't get angry at me. Get angry at yourself. <sighs> of course they get a critical. Why wouldn't they? <sighs> Fucking aggravating. Tame Machismo. Mastered Spin Punch. Can still fly with him, apparently. That's good. I definitely shouldn't be able to, but I'm just gonna keep letting this. I'm just gonna keep doing this, I guess. As long as they let me. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. I'll bet if I switch out, they won't let me um, fly anymore. I don't think there's any more bosses here. Have I fought the boss? There's the bird one in the first place. I forget what the boss is here. I've definitely fought it before. I don't remember what the button for map is. Oh, there. Okay. So this is tell me the items I've gotten. Or the ones I have total. Fancy stone. Oh, interesting. Don't get one. I don't know how to read these documents either. Neo mushroom. Oh wait, so I got the mushroom. Isn't that wasn't that the thing I needed to talk to the people in Ryuin? I wonder if they just weren't available for whatever reason. I should try and go back after I do this again. I don't know if there's like another item I need. I might have to look up, an, uh, look up a guide. Depending on if this adventure is fruitful or not. Oof, that could have been bad. What annoys me when I do those is that I wish when I did the, um, when I did the attacks that are more likely to hit, I had done like a power attack. Because if they're going to counter it, I might as well hit them with a much harder attack. Okay. Um, what else? Let's talk about more anime. I also watched Assassination, uh, uh, Assassination Classroom. I watched the first season. I tried to start the second season, and then I realized I didn't have the second season downloaded on my tablet, so that was unfortunate. Um, but yeah, it was interesting. Um, interesting plot, interesting development. It's when I first realized that the main voice the voice of the dude who does assassinate of, of um, what's his name? Octo Sensei or something? I can't remember. It's a pun on Octopus. It's the, um, he's, um, the voice actor who voices him voices fucking nearly everyone else in the goddamn world. Um, he voices Lelouch. He voices, um, I'm trying to think. They've done a bunch. Um, 
I think he voiced... Oh, that, this is the other one. Because he also voiced... Um, I can't remember his name anymore. The, I j literally just watched this like two months ago. Um, the dude from Spice and Wolf. Because I also watched Spice and Wolf. That was pretty good. Well, now I'm fucked. Oh, no, he's still... I can still use him. Document 12. All right. Um, yeah, I was watching... Uh, I watched Spice and Wolf as well. But, um, Assassination Classroom was good. I haven't finished it, but supposedly it actually has an ending, so maybe I should go back to it. Can you just, like, hit, please? I pressed the wrong button again. I don't know what button just to counter yet. Oh, it's L2. Probably should have guessed he was pressing square, if I'm being honest. Can I just hit him with anything? Please? Please? Alright, I'm willing to bet it's still square. I don't know why I keep doing this. Oh wow, he's got a lot of HP too. That's definitely a Rhino combined with something else. Alright, I don't know why I keep pressing every button except square. Because I'm so used to pressing it for my own attacks. Team up. Oh, he actually used X-Dot last time. Damn it. This is really frustrating. I could just take that one to the face, I guess. Am I gonna lose here? Stop getting bullish! I hit square that time, too. What the fuck? How am I losing so badly to this dude? I can't hit him, first of all, and then just every move he fucking does. <sighs> He's rotating between square and X. Just... I'm gonna lose here. I can't believe I'm gonna lose. Thank you. I still have to hit him myself, though. Which is being no is not going well. I missed. I'm dead. I can't believe I fucking lost. How did this dude just one-shot me? <sighs> that really, really makes me angry. I want to break my controller in half. And I probably could. This one's old. <sighs> no reason to lose like that. Well, everyone clear your schedules. We're all resting. Probably gonna have to rest for two weeks, too. I can't... That was such a dumb battle. I kept missing the counters, like, which is my own fault. But it's just like... The fact that I couldn't land any of my hits on this fucking... Not to mention he had so much HP to begin with. Alright. I should look this up, though, just in case. That's gonna be very annoying. Searcher 4. Thank you. I'm just gonna search Mushroom, because I think that was the last thing I had to do. New Horizons, that pose how you'll be able to compete in turns again in the Razor Rank Rank C. Okay, I did this already. Upon returning with the healing mushrooms, you'll be presented with new features such as countering tag battles, new tasks, new area to explore. Uh, the first time you'll get a weird shrine on the third floor. Don't worry, you'll get that junk on the sec. Er, you probably need to go here about three times. The first time you'll, need, you'll find a weird shrine on the third floor. Don't worry, you'll get that junk on the second trip. Look at it on the fifth floor. After this, you'll finally be able to compete in reunion battles. Not only if the association would recognize the awesome area, you wouldn't have to go through all three of that. I hate when people write like that. So I do have to go back to the Kalaragi jungle, which is fantastic. I can't leave. Okay. That's... Oh, God. That killed all my momentum. I'm just like... How do you come back from that? I was so rusty. I thought I was starting to get used to it again. 
The fact that it was already missing one of my monsters too just hurt so much worse. Alright, let's keep going. <clears throat> well, I can tell you this, probably gonna be a shorter part. I could go back, they're not that tired. But then Peepo has a competition the next day. Fuck it. Gotta go back. I gotta do what I gotta do. Can't take that lion down. Maybe I shouldn't have explored as much. That was part of the reason. Because whenever I go and look for like extra treasure, I don't find anything good. Alright, let's go to... Rexkin. Let's fly through the whole area. I don't know if this goes faster or not. I thought there was a lower... I can't figure out the encounter rates in this. Because sometimes I'll go like an entire floor with no encounters. Then sometimes I'll get like four back to back. I gotta look up how to get these different status effects. Like, I don't know what I'm doing wrong. <sighs> like, why? Let me attack. Why is Megaton Kick the first one he has? Hit him. <sighs> Bullish might, might make me kill someone. If I see the words bullish again. Or Nilvana, that's just as bad. Oh, you... Oh, you missed three times in a row? Well, now we're gonna make it impossible to hit them, so figure it out, it's doofus. I'll bet the game calls you doofus, too. There, it wore off. Still can't hit it. Still can't hit it. Still can't hit it. There we go. Oh, my God. And is, this is getting worse and worse. <laughs> Never playing this game again. There's a good reason I didn't do it. Alright. Um, let's see. What else? Kill the kill. That's all the anime I watched. The rest was all American shows. Not even American, just real life shows. I uh, watched Jessica Jones Season 2, that was great. I wrote that note months ago when it came out. Uh, since then, <laughs> since then I've watched um, uh, Avengers Infinity War, which just came out last week. Much, much better. I'm not going to spoil it. I don't know how many people have seen it. Um, very, very good movie. Would recommend. My brother doesn't even follow the Marvel movies, and he liked it too, so I don't know. My Discord has a weird hate, like... Oh, that's the other thing. There's Discord now. You should join. Um, my Discord has a weird hate Marvel movies. I don't understand. Somehow the people who like my Digimon videos, do n none of them have the same interest as me, and I don't know how this happened. That is not at all how this is supposed to work. Something has gone wrong. I don't know if I can explore that tree. I gotta... I gotta look at my monsters. I don't know what they can do. Customizing. They... Didn't give a new attack, but Peepo did, and so did he, I think. Can I not add any more attacks? Oh, okay. Um. Okay, so we have Megaton Kick, Slap, Flick, these two. I think I have all of these. Right? Even looks like I'm using... Oh, okay, wait, I see it now. Spin punch. Accuracy rate is high. I'm all about that. What, did he, what was he using? The accuracy rate on this isn't as high, so we'll put that there. And then... I need this one, okay. I think I've got all the attacks listed now. So I'm missing one. I should probably... put flick here, and then Megaton kick here. Accuracy above all. Atomic Punch, which is short range, does crazy damage. I might as well put that one instead of um, the Kick. This Kick has terrible accuracy too, but this one also does a lot more damage, so that's probably for the better. And then I can add Lore, but I seem to have gotten rid of that. Or I don't have any to begin with. Traits, Rock Body. Okay, we have Rock Body, reduces damage, harder to dodge, increased power, moves, things, fists, hips, 
I'll probably get rid of golden hip. I don't know any moves with the hips that I use. Throwing, shooting, once you ride, power ride, golden foot, increases power of beats, increases power of counterattacks, machismo, increases strength but intelligence attacks damage easily. That's not good. Alright, what's pe people got? Dirt search, king's fist, cave search, keen fang, golden foot, sonic nail, hyper beam. Don't think I need hyper beam. And then ice lore, unless you add ice powers to skill. I don't know how I got that. Flight Ride, King's Fist, Hard Scale, Strong. Okay. Um, I should definitely add Ice Lord to all of his stuff. I don't know what... I think because there's like resistances and shit like that in this. Upper Charge. Do I have this equipped? Yes. Okay. Um, also, people got new moves and I didn't add them. Alright, let's add Ice Lord to the shit that doesn't have it. Oh, okay. So it like they have bonus they have benefits and they don't. This one's a really accurate attack, so maybe I should keep Ice Lore off. This one's already not the most accurate, but I can do more damage with it. This one does a lot of damage. Um This one's not that accurate, but does more damage, so we'll put that on it too. Okay. And then, he got a new move, I didn't even see it. Blow, which is like a fireball. And then uppercut, which I don't see, oh, I do have uppercut, okay. Okay, blow is high on accuracy. Higher than this one is, I think. So put that there. I think that could work. Okay, yeah, I think... I think he was gonna wear, learn wind lore and I canceled it. So that would have been useful because I don't have any lore for him. Alright. Moving right along. And moving right along. Oh, um, yeah. Jessica Jones, Jones Season 2 is fun. That's been out for a while, but I can say this because anyone's gonna watch it. Trish is awful. Jessica Jones 2. Just terrible. Just. They butchered. Every character, and not butchered, but every character of Jessica Jones is an asshole, except for Malcolm. That's very upsetting. It's just hard to like them. Like, Jessica Jones, it's like a lovable rogue, so that's fine. But Trish, it's like, I only did this for you. She's just, like, I've never... Jessica Jones Season 2 does something that I've never seen, which is they gave Trish a back... Or they gave a flashback... And they made someone look worse with a flashback. Like, usually they're supposed to be, like, redeeming. I've never seen a flashback where it made me go, Wow, I hate this character even more because they were even worse before. But that happened. That, re that really happened. I wouldn't lie to you. So that was interesting. Um, what else? I've got Love Season 2 and 3 on there. That was good. Um, Love is a good series. It's on Netflix. It was written by Judd, or written, directed, created, whatever. By Judge, Judd Apatow. I always want to call him Judge. I feel like his name shouldn't be Judd. Doesn't make sense. Um, but it was it was good. Would recommend. Um, and it stars um, what's her name? Uh, it stars Britta from Community. Jillian Jacobs, and also has um, I don't know what else this dude's been. I don't know what else this dude's been in, but um. I forget what his name is. It's like, uh, anyway, really nerdy looking guy. Um, he's pretty good in it. It's brutally real about relationships at times. Uh, about settling and how not everyone's perfect and stuff like that. But it's pretty cool. I enjoyed it. I watched it with um, my friend Catherine. We talked about it a lot. Uh, they recommend, she told me, or her and her friends recommended that I watch Easy, which Carlos said is trash, but his girlfriend likes it. I think it's supposed to be like a, um, like a single, like each episode is its own story, kind of like Black Mirror, but, um, it's like about relationships and different stuff like that. She liked it, but, I don't know, I'm, I'm hesitant to start it. And then, what else? What the hell did I write? Mm, I can't read my own things. What else have I watched since then? Um, a lot of stand-up, Greg Davies stand-up really good. Uh, if you haven't seen that, uh, Taskmaster starts this week. Can't wait to watch more of that. I haven't watched panel shows in forever. 
Because I don't get Dave, like UK viewers do. I can't just like pop on a channel and hope that they show up. And they vehemently took down a lot of uh, the YouTube stuff, which is really... I mean, good for them, because intellectual property theft and all that, but at the same time, fuck them, because they don't make it available to Americans, so... Um... There's that... I'm talking about the games I was playing. I, uh, recently replayed, or I played through God of War. That was fun on a bun. The new God of War is really good. Um, highly recommend it to everyone. It's... It kind of... How do I put this? It's not really... It's not a lot like the old God of Wars, but I feel like it's more of like a product of the times. Like those, those wouldn't do as well today, if that makes sense. So I feel like it makes. Uh, I feel like it was a natural trans transition. So I think it does work. It was definitely a fun ride. My brother loves it. Uh, he says it's like his favorite game. Um, so that's cool. And then what else? Um, Watch or play God of War. I'm still, I'm. If I was still a trophy hunting man, it would be like a decent platinum, I think. Um, because there's not too much to do. Just like the collectibles would be an annoyance. But I'm done trophy hunting. I uh, not done. I'll go back eventually, but just I'm still on a break. After getting a hundred platinums killed me, especially racing with Sean, and then losing that race. It just it's my motivation is gone. Um, but yeah, so I, I put that down, and I finally finished Yakuza 0, which was a lot of fun. I've been, I played that around the time I played Nier last year, and Nier was amazing, and I loved it, and Yakuza was great, and I loved it, but I, due to a couple circumstances, like, I lost power when I was playing Yakuza one time, during, over the summer, and lost, like, hours of progress, and that made me not want to go back to it for a while. And there was another time, I forget what happened, I think... I think that happened to me twice. Not power failure, but something else caused me to like lose a save. Um, and I just didn't want to go back to it. Oof. I don't appreciate this. <laughs> That's a great attack. I like it. it. Does a lot of guts damage too. So it might be good to get my hit rate up, and then attack with a different one. Um, I think that might be a good uh, plan, just, just to get your hit rate up, and then attack with like a more powerful move. Hey, Sit the fuck down. I feel like the enemy never uses circle, they always use square or X, so I should always just try and counter with those. Okay. I'm just trying to move past this. I sort of scanning for treasure. This this kind of flying doesn't really work for that as as well. Because I'm a little too high up to see the ground properly. But I don't see any. Um yeah, the new God of War is a lot of fun though. Uh, and then I but yeah, so I finished Yakuza Zero as well. And that was good. Yakuza Zero is great, because that part of at parts, it felt like it was a really intense, like, anime. And other times, it felt like a really intense soap opera. <laughs> and other times, it felt like the most goofiest shit I've done in my life. And it's just like... Yakuza does what Grand Theft Auto used to do really well. Which is... It would take itself stone-faced, dead serious when doing the story. Like, everything would be very intense, people were dying. Lots of injuries, lots of mafia type shit. Or I should say, Yakuza. And, um... Yeah, they took... It was all, like, you know, there was no brevity in it. And then... You go outside. Like, say you're, like, meeting in a bar. You go outside, and then fucking... We'll see, like, a dude in his underwear. And he just, like, runs around from video store to video store just jerking off. And then there's other things where it's like you'll do like karaoke or do a fucking disco dance in the middle for no reason. It's not required by the story. And I love that about it. I love the disconnect. I feel like Grand Theft Auto used to do that. Like Grand Theft Auto used to be like really intense story and then like ridiculous things you could do with the gameplay. But I feel like 
they kind of lost that aspect a little bit when um, when Saints Row got popular. Because Saints Row took the uh, took the whole ridiculous parts to a whole new levels. Like they do it so much better. Um, so now Grand Theft Auto has to be completely serious, or it just doesn't, or it's not doing anything unique. This one has a lot of uh, HP. If you could go down, that'd be great. Also, that attack is good because it does a lot of uh, guts damage, too. Hey! Easy peasy. It kind of feels like... I haven't really used Peepo that much, but it feels like Golem might be my strongest one right now. Chester obtained Lucky Star. Chester can't obtain any more. Abandoned Lucky Star? No. What can we get rid of? Golden Hip. I don't know what Lucky Star does. Like, it luck does it increase just like drops from after battles and stuff like that? I don't know. Um, yeah, I'm trying to think of what else. Shit, if I'm if I'm gonna try and record every day, I better have more shit to talk about. Uh, uh I just, let's talk about Yakuza some more again. So I started playing um, Yakuza Kiwami, which is the remake of Yakuza One. And so far, it's pretty good. It's jarring a bit, because y Yakuza 1 was written, I don't know, back in 2004, 2005, uh, when it first came out. And uh, it's 2018 now, and Yakuza 0 just came out last year. That's a cool looking monster. Uh, but yeah, Yakuza 0, which is the prequel, just came out last year. So obviously some, some stuff, like, I don't know how to put this, there's some drastically different character changes between now and then. And there's a couple I can think of. One of the main characters in Yakuza 0 is Goro Majima, who is a huge character I learned in the series. Basically, um, kind of like a wild card. And he'll always show up when the main character doesn't least expects it. And just he's actually it's they've actually got a mechanic where he'll randomly show up while you're like running around the city and just challenge you to a fight. And it's always like a, it's basically like a boss fight. And, um, that's pretty cool. Um, but he's also like a character in the story and stuff like that. But you play as him in Zero, and he's like mild-mannered and shit like that. And in this, or in, oh shit, I did it again. And in, um, and in the r real Yakuza, not Zero, he's like batshit and crazy. And there's, uh, the prequel is supposed to show how he became that, but I didn't really feel like that's what it did. I kind of felt like in the prequel he was still like a kind of mild-mannered straight guy. Not st straight man, I should say. Um, like kind of just playing the serious character, but like, I don't know. He kind of just like decides, ah, fuck it, life's not worth living like if I'm going to play like that. Oh, well, this looks like some serious shit. Just start off with Chester. We've come all this way, but still no junk. This is strange. Mr. Conab talked as if he was scattered all over the place. Wait, I hear the voice of a monster. It's saying, shall not forgive those who dirty the jungle. Something's headed this way. Watch out, Rio. Yeah, I remembered the accent. It's been years since I've done this video, but I've still remembered it. What the fuck is that? I have no idea where you are. Arbor Mogi? Interesting. Okay, we got a hit chain. Let's use a stronger attack. I'm definitely not gonna hit with it. Here we go. Atomic Punch. Damn it. I wanted to do as much damage as I could. I feel like for a golem, he doesn't have nearly enough uh, HP. And that is a flaw of my own design. Hit him. Hit him. Shit. Damn it. I gotta switch out. I can't let him die. Yeah, you guessed wrong. Only been using circle. Well, that really went pretty easy, actually. I guess Peepo is definitely my strongest. Hey, Rex gets level 10. Rex obtained Thunderlore. Rex mastered B attack. 
Oh, look at that. The stray monster left something behind. What is it? What is it? Looks like some kind of machine. Could this be the junk that Mr. Conab was talking about? Yeah, bro. Yeah, probably. What could it be for? Oh, my God, that gives me a bad feeling. Hmm, wonder what it is. Well, whatever. Let's hurry and take this Ryu and Mo to the Ryu and Monster Association. With this, we can enter the competition of Ryu and... I know. I hate it, too. Whew. Well, I'll do that next week. I say next week. I'll do that next time. <laughs> See you in another ten months. Uh, but yeah. Ideally, I'd like to play more of it. Will I? I don't know. Maybe? I'm not in control of my own fate. Ooh, I actually don't want to save over that one. Just in case something goes wrong with this recording. As they usually do. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. And uh, tune in for the uh, next one eventually. It, there will be one. I don't know when, but it'll come out. I'll finish this game one day.